When you I still got the rap game in a choke. Shout out to Canada, those are my blokes. Shout out to Canada, those are my blokes. Shout out to Philly, the city that's fucking gritty. Ain't nobody in the city that's really been fucking with me. Got me. You know, showing me love and sending me prayers because it is hard to be in this. Baddies is not all rainbows and unicorns. Like, I love you, Taseki, so much, sister. Isn't that we all go, every single one of us go through shit. You know what I'm saying? And I listen, I don't have bonds with all the girls. But Anna is definitely a girl that I have a bond with. And no matter what we went through, like, I still love her. I have no, no malicious intent for her. Like, she's such a vibrant person. She's funny. She's beautiful. She's young. She's talented. Like, you feel me? I have no hate for anybody except if I really don't fucking like you. Then if I don't like you, bitch, I don't like you and I hate you and go to hell with no air conditioner. Cool. But I think that's why I wanted to get on here because any other time, like, I really don't care to address anything. But I wanted to address this because I see all of the negative. Y'all don't have to be so negative and hateful all the time. Like, we're humans. We have feelings. We feel too. Like, don't get me wrong. I, I know I'm a bitch sometimes. But to know me is to love me. And so to, I just said that to say this. Like, you feel me? Why don't y'all focus on the new music that we got coming out? Like... Exactly. Baddies is hard. Like, it's, it's, it's not easy. You feel me? Thank God that we have people, you know, thank, shout out to the Zeus team. Like, we have people we build bonds with and they're there for us throughout the process. But we're, remember, we're there without our family. I flew my mom out to Puerto Rico and my aunt out to Puerto Rico because I felt like I was starting to go into like, I don't know, like, I don't trust. Who do I trust? Like, it was a lot going on, and I just needed to hug my mother. Like, I, when I called my mother to come to Puerto Rico, it was not to fight Anna. I literally called my mother like, hey, Ma, I'm going to fly you out because I just need a hug. You feel me? So with that being said, I just don't want this to carry on. So this is for your entertainment, and that's okay. Y'all can be entertained, but just remember that we're humans. Like, you feel me? I'm such a cancer, y'all. Y'all don't understand. I'm emotional. Like, I'm a cancer. You feel me? And I know on TV before, I've always been, like, so hard and, like, but when you meet me in person, like, I'm really not like that. And everybody could tell you. I'm, like, so sweet. I love my friends. I love my family. And I just want my family to be good. I just want my friends. I don't want my family in these fucking problems. Like, are y'all serious? So, um... Just remember when y'all watch this scene with me and Anna on Sunday, this is two people who love each other, whose hands were forced to do what we had to do. You feel me? And for all the people out there, my mom did not get tore up. Like, security was there. Motherfuckers barely got his. Anna, I already know. We already spoke. You got to remember when we're in confessionals, we have to stay in that moment and how we felt in that moment. So I can't be mad at what she said. Um, and... You know, it obviously, it, it bothers me, but listen, I understand at the end of the day, like, that's how you felt in the moment, whatever, cool, but, you know, yeah, nobody was jumped, like, my mom is just who she is, I can't help that either, like, but if I was there, it wouldn't have happened, and I, I hate the situation for both of us, and I hate that we have to relive it. And I hate that y'all fucking act like demons. Some of y'all are like demons in the comments. And I rebuke that shit in the name of Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, and all Mary's little lambs. I rebuke that. From me, from Anna, from my mom. I rebuke that, for real. Like I said, two people who really care about each other. Who still care about each other, whose hand was forced. And by the way... I never motherfucking had a plan to jump on and her manager with Bianca. Let me set that shit motherfucking clear too while I'm on this live. Since we're here addressing things, let me address that as well. Nobody ever had plans. Why would I ever jump on her? That makes no sense. And we have mutual friends like Tzatziki and Big. That would put them people in. You, you understand what I'm saying? Whatever me and the blue hair Smurf girl had, that shit will unfold. It will air. 
I feel how I feel. She can feel how she feels. She likes doing all this on the internet. That's fine with me. I'm good off that. I want to get in the studio and continue to make hits and be my best motherfucking self. Now, I'm learning and I'm growing. So any mistakes that I make, y'all don't have to crucify me for them. I've had people slide in my DM and be like, bitch, you said that I and I'm like, no, this is what it was. Like, I'm sorry if I offended you or, you know, whatever the case may be. And then they be like, oh, okay, well, now that you put it like that, like, we didn't notice. And I'm like, yeah, y'all don't be knowing what goes on behind the scenes. Y'all don't be knowing a lot of shit. Like, y'all just see these three-minute scenes with us and me acting like a motherfucking Tasmanian devil. So, with that being said, um, that was never my best friend. That was never my best friend. I did that girl a favor by getting her on the show because she's going through court cases with her baby father's family trying to take. We're not even going to get into that. But anyways, I tr I tried to do the right thing. I'm always trying to put females on. When Spice was a judge for Baddies Caribbean, that was me who made the connection. Okay. DTB. That was me. I made the connection. I brought up Asian Doll's name. I don't know if she was ever asked before to do baddies. I, I don't know none of that. I just know I, I brought her name up and they asked me, who do you not get, don't get along with? And when I brought up Bianca first, I'm not going to say to who as Zeus, but when I first brought up Bianca, that person was like, no, we're not doing this. We're not making this a love and hip hop thing. We're trying to stay away from love and hip hop talent. Like we already got you. So that was what I was told. So then when I got the call, like, hey, are you cool with Bianca? Like, how you feel about Bianca? I was like, yes, bring her on. Like, yes, she's going to bring something to this season. Like, I feel like she... <sighs> Anyways, there's always three sides to every story. Hers, hers, and then there's the truth, right? And I don't really give a fuck if y'all believe my side of the story or not. That's why I don't get on here every Sunday and run my mouth and say, I just got on here today because the honest situation is very sensitive for me. It does bother me that we have to relive this. And I just don't want our relationship to be tainted after we've already got past this because y'all fans don't know how to realize that this shit was shot months ago and bitches are already past this have been in the club together have cried it out fought it out and we are where we are like i just i'm not angry anymore like I don't want to be angry. So I hope that y'all not mad at me for not wanting to be angry. And I hope that y'all could maybe get to know me a little bit more. Try to get to know me a little bit more. And stop just thinking that I'm like somebody I'm not. God don't like ugly. And he's not too fond of pretty neither. So remember that. And remember when you're hating from behind your telephone and your computers. I'm living my best life. I'm traveling the world. I'm getting to a bag. I'm doing what I love to do in life, which is make music. I have a nonprofit organization. I help DV victims. I'm an advocate for the LGBTQ community. Like, I really do shit. I, I do lupus give back. So, yeah. I'm not messy all the time. And I can be a messy bitch, but... Anyways, my manager's calling me. It's time to get business. They probably going to take my live after this, so y'all probably won't see me for another year. <laughs> and tune in, Baddies Caribbean, every Sunday. I love y'all. Stay tuned. I got a new song dropping. Barbie Bentega, Mariah Lynn, Levels dropping July 28th with the video on World Star. So make sure y'all tap into that. I love y'all, and thank you for everybody sending me love. I love, 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 love y'all. I need love today. Just give me love today.